In this video tutorial, we are going to discuss about symmetry of a rectangle, whether a rectangle is symmetric or not. And if it is symmetric, then what number of lines of symmetry or line of symmetry is possible in the case of a rectangle? Now we have this rectangle here. And if I say that the first line of symmetry can be this one. Now, why this is a line of symmetry or a mirror line or axis of symmetry? Because if you place a mirror on this line, right, this line of symmetry is dividing these two, uh, is this rectangle into two equal halves. And if you place a mirror on this line, then if you look this left portion of this rectangle, this left half, if you look this left half into the mirror, then the image that will be formed will be exactly similar to this right one. In fact, it will overlap to this one. And if you look this right half into a mirror, then the image that will be formed will be exactly overlap this left portion, that it will be exactly similar to this one. Another way to look the mirror image is that if you imagine this line as a folding line, and around this line, if you fold any one of this or two of these equal uh, uh, opposite halves, that is if you fold this half and this half together, such that you try to overlap them, then what will you get? You'll get something like this. And what this dotted uh, lines are showing is, these dotted points are showing that actually you have turned, you have folded this left portion and you have tried to overlap it on the right portion. And when you do that, in that case, this vertex comes exactly here. This vertex exactly overlaps with this vertex. This line exactly overlaps with this one and that has been shown here by dotted points. And this one exactly overlap with this one. That is, if you fold, then the two equal halves, the opposite halves will overlap with each other, making it a perfect mirror image. Therefore, yes, this is a line of symmetry. What we discussed here in this case, same thing will be applicable in this case. You can see if I try to fold this one, then it will exactly overlap on this upward section of this divided rectangle. These dotted points or dotted lines are showing that it has exactly or perfectly overlapped with this upward section, making it these two equal halves, making them mirror images of each other. And let's look at this one. This is a line that is passing from uh, the opposite vertices. Now, will it be a line of symmetry? In a previous L1 and L2, we have we saw that those two lines were a line of symmetry, lines of symmetry. What about this one? Well, if you try to fold any one of these two equal halves, then what you will get? You'll get something like this. These dotted lines, dotted points are showing that actually you have folded this upper portion around this folding line. When you have folded this, it will form something like this. Okay, and it's not, this vertex is not coming on this vertex. It's not overlapping. This line is not overlapping on this one. And this one is not overlapping this one, right? So if you fold it, then some you'll get something like this right so it's not overlapping the equal halves the opposite halves are not overlapping with each other it means that this will these two equal halves are not the mirror images of each other therefore these two this will not be the line of symmetry whatever we have discussed just now will be applicable here also in this case even in this case, when you try to fold this section around this L4, you'll get something like this. So this is, again, not line of symmetry. So in the case of rectangle, we get only two line of symmetries, lines of symmetry. That is, this is first one. And this is the second one. These two are lines of symmetry. So 
lines of symmetry. is 2. The number of lines of symmetry is 2 for rectangle. 